understanding the role of a resistor in limiting current to a diode. Today, let's talk about why a resistor is so important when connecting a diode or an LED to a power source. We'll also explore what can happen if you don't use one. Experiment with two circuits. To understand this better, let's look at two simple circuits. 1. First, a circuit where a red LED is connected directly to a 9-volt battery. 2. Second, a circuit where we add a resistor in series between the LED and the battery. Case 1. LED without a resistor. If you connect a red LED directly to a 9-volt battery, the LED will burn out almost instantly. Why does this happen? Well, an LED has very low internal resistance, which means too much current will flow through it. LED are designed to work at a specific forward voltage and a safe current limit. If you exceed that limit, the LED will be destroyed. Case 2. LED with a resistor. To protect the LED, we add a current limiting resistor in series with it. This resistor reduces the current flow and drops the excess voltage, ensuring the LED operates safely. What is the forward voltage drop of a red LED? Different colored LED have different forward voltage drops. For a red LED, the forward voltage drop is typically around 1.8 to 2.2 volts. This means if you supply 9 volts, the LED will use about 2 volts, and the resistor needs to handle the remaining 7 volts. How much current should we limit? LED usually operate safely at 10 to 20 milliamps, or ma. To calculate the right resistor value, we use Ohm's law. Here's the formula. Resistance equals supply voltage minus LED voltage, divided by the desired current. So, for our example, R equals 9 volts minus 2 volts by 20 milliamperes. R equals 7 volts by 0.02 amps. R equals 350 ohms. The closest standard resistor values are 330 ohms or 360 ohms. Why is the resistor important? The resistor does a few critical things. It controls the current, preventing too much current from damaging the LED. It ensures proper operation, allowing the LED to shine at its rated brightness. It increases the lifespan of the LED. Without a resistor, the LED might burn out right away. It reduces heat. Too much current generates excess heat, which can damage components over time. Conclusion So, when using LED, always include a current limiting resistor in series. This protects the LED and ensures it performs well for a long time. This is a fundamental principle in electronics, and understanding it helps you design safe and efficient circuits.